guys, it's LPH Jazzy Beats here, and today we are up with another review or oh, whatever. Sorry that my voice is croaky, it's because I have a sore throat. It's to this pet shop's from Wilco. There were also some that this pet shop, like the new generation stuffed toy kind of things. It's like those ones that you can clip onto like photographs or anything. But I don't like it because like it wasn't even soft. It was like really hard. Yeah, let's just open up. That's all the LPS I got. Okay, so I'm gonna start with one of them. I'm just gonna pick it out randomly and then I'm gonna show you the packaging and then I'll go on to opening it. This is the Littlest Pet Shop series two of the Tinsy LPS. And then it comes with a pet, uh, like a keychain and something. I don't know what that is. And then like a little house. I'm not really sure. All of these have different like colors of this. And since it's a, a blind box, I don't want to get duplicates, so I got all of these like keychain things, different colors. I might actually get this off, and it's just a keychain. You hang this accessory in here. Well, it's not really accessory, but it's like a keychain thing. So yeah, I'm just gonna go through the checklist. This is the whole of series two. I don't know how many in total, but oh, there's 24. I should have read that there. For me, I get. No duplicates. So this is the pet eyes. Ooh, it looks so cute. So in total, it comes with all of this, including the pet. I assume this is how it goes because I've seen it in LPS Hannah's video. Hook this keychain onto this hole here. Okay, so like that. You add this bone to this hook thing, and then you hook it on here as well. Okay, so this is the pet. Is this like? white teal color it gets a little house you pull this off and you put this inside because there's a hole underneath and then you just put this on top and you press it down and then you can put this in you can bring this anywhere on your bag anything they should have done like milk or something with this it's not going all the way through okay i'm gonna have some issues so i'm just gonna do this off camera okay so i couldn't hook it on so i'm just putting it separate it comes with the key and the key goes in the keyhole, if you open it, there's a little alcove and you can put the cow here with the hole like that and then you can close it and bring it on your one to bring it in. This cow is adorable. It's only one color, it's like a creamy white. It has this really cute cheese colored collar as well. It comes with this bear, which is just a cream white color. I think Hasbro needs to improve on the plainness. I feel like it's too plain, like maybe adds a little bit of color. Other than that, it's adorable and I love it. I'm definitely gonna use this igloo in sets because I can use it for like a little pet's house and it's a brown color but I like it because it's like really cute I have another Tinsy monkey but it's not like this oh I get it now I know why this too I've been doing this wrong the whole time okay let's use this example so basically there's two because this is one and so is the feather like that and I've been doing it like that that's why it's not working let me just go do that really quickly. Okay, I've done all of them now, so they are properly done. Okay, so this is like a little translucent bird cage. I'm thinking. I'm not exactly sure. It's also really pretty. Also, the other ones they have, I didn't show you, but they had so much detail. Like this one, it has like the lines of the wood crate. This one has the cheese. This one has like the ice melting. The, the ice stacked up into, on top of each other to make the igloo. And this one has like the fuzz thing for the tennis ball and this is a little birdie it's a blue one so this one is like the same as that cheese and the cow you just use the key monkey the same mold as this monkey i think it's like a reddish purple colored monkey the first thing i saw when i saw this it reminded me of watermelon so this is like the red from the watermelon and this is the green but overall this color scheme isn't very good like could have done yellow and then a banana it's like alice in wonderland oh my gosh i love how they did that mm. So it's like a teapot and like you know how like the mouse lives in the teapot and you can pour it and you can put the mouse in here as well like, ah! and also the cup is right size for lps this one is probably my favorite because of the color scheme it's so cute and some of these also have articulation at the neck oh it's like a star what's not this oh it's a little kitty 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 cat cat what on earth was that this one is another key Luckily, it can fit round now nah, the kite, but it can still open like this using your fingers. It's kind of the same thing, and then you just put the pet here. So this is a plain cat. Looks like Brooke. 
Did you hear that, guys? I just cracked my knee. I don't know why, but like some of my pets, you see like that line? Like some of my pets have those lines on it. And I don't know why, like maybe it's the sun or something. Maybe the sun has done something. I'm not sure because there isn't that much sun here. It's like raining. But I don't know why. It's just kind of a setting because all the pets are really pretty. But then when you look at that, then it's like a line there. So... Uh, I think it's maybe a factory defect, but I'm not sure. Anyways, this is maybe my, my third favorite. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, why are all these like key ones really cute? So basically, it's this really cute cat case. It's the same cat that I like from this star set over here, there. It's a chocolate brown though, and then it's like a paw print. So this is the last set that we opened, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine ten out of 24 hope you guys enjoyed please subscribe like and if you subscribe hit that bell notification to get notified of when i post videos and i'll see you guys later bye hey guys so again i saw them in Wilco, and then i really wanted to get them and this time there i got one of the series two so hopefully I, it's not duplicate but i do have the series three so the rest of series three in total, I got seven. They were still a little bit in the pot. I'll start with the cat there, and then I'll start with the series two, because we already know, like, the checklist and everything. Then I'll go right ahead into the series three. So the cat is this Scottish fold, so it's really cute. But I didn't like it because, like, it wasn't even soft. It was, like, really hard. This was three pounds, and the um, boxes were one pound fifty. So overall, she is really cute. That's why I got her. Basically, for the clip, you press the legs here and it opens. In the book clip, it just says this and her name is Pinky Calicoco. So I'm going to start with the series 2. Is this the same? Oh, phew, if it's not. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Because these two like carry-on bags are like really sim like similar, so I thought they were the same. But luckily, I noticed that this was pink and this one was like a teal blue. You can see here that she has like a splotch of mud. Sadly, she has factory defects, like some paint must have scratched on it. It's really cute. I love her little face expression. Okay, so now I'm going to start with the series three. So these are different. You see, it has number one and then here has number two. Here, it doesn't say it. So I guess you just open it in any order. Let's go on and check the checklist for series three. There's 24 to collect like series two. Oh, I really like the koala though. It's really cute. And then here's the back. Oh, that koala is even more cuter. Ooh, hopefully I get it. So the like container thing that it comes in is this little fire hydrant, which is blue and red. You can't really see it, but there's like details with the screws and then like a pole print and a screw. There's also some details at the top. And here's the poodle, which is adorable. It's like so textured. I love the gradient on its face. So the thing it comes with, like the house thing, is like this white pumpkin. I'm not exactly sure what this vegetable is called. This literally looks like this grumpy cat here. They could be like best friends. This is another one of these teacup things. This is probably my favorite one so far because of the colors. It's basically this cupcake with some sculpted sprinkles, which I wish they could have like colored it here's the little mouse it's so cute but i feel like this color combination on a mouse especially is like mm. hasbro do very colorful things this one i didn't show you another one but these are the ones that use a key and open it these locks aren't actually like you have to use the key you can just like if you lose the key for example you can just use your nail open it like this and it just opens like that i think there's something wrong with this i think the problem is its eyes i feel like they put the eyes a bit too big or something or the face is too big i honestly don't know comment down below never mind i don't think the comment section will be open but if it is then comment down below what do you think like is this creepy or not to you because i feel like this is creepy this is probably one of my favorites as well because of the b color scheme was mm, but i guess i can kind of see where they're going because this is more like a mint green and there's a green on bananas i think this is another one of my favorites because of the color scheme the thing that is a bit negative about it is because this worm is very plain like maybe they could have put more color into it i mean like worms are one color but more color this is the whole set together and 
I really love this like key because it's like a flower and it's it's so detailed and like textured. I'm sorry if this is a really long video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please subscribe, like, and comment down below. Is this LPS right here like creepy? Like, is it just me? And comment down below if you really like these like clip things. Are they creepy as well? Hey guys, it's LPS Chatty Pete here, and sorry for not posting so much. It's because I've moved to a totally new countries i don't actually have a much um things to film with because well all my lps are being shipped here where's my mascot well i also shipped her and that's where i need to talk about so my mascot head broke off when i was taking these instagram pictures as you can see in this last photo here she it's a bit like this like that yeah that's when it broke she was fake that's what I'm okay about, but I still really loved her and she was really expensive. Got scammed for getting her. I thought she was real, but she was fake. But you know, that's what life does to you when you get LPS online and stuff. For my mascot, I'll be using other pets till I get an actual real one. And if you're wondering, well, where, if you shipped all your LPS over, why do you have this straw hair cat? Well, this straw hair cat is actually new. I bought it. I bought it from the littlest, um, pet shop stop the link of their shop in the description down below um so yeah they're a lovely shop so these are the short hair that i got they're really cheap honestly as well so this is one she's authentic she has a bit of marks but yeah she's she's fine i also got this husky which is really cute and in really good condition honestly all these pets are really in good condition i don't remember what the price of this one was but i remember this one was about like um 10 to 15 us dollars and then yeah here's the husky he's really cute he's authentic as well and then i also got this bulldog which i've been wanting for so long however it has a bit of scratch marks for example here and then i think at the bottom somewhere here yeah there's an initial but he's also authentic and he's fine so that's good and we also i also got this cocker spaniel no the dress did not come with it, I just wanted to experiment. It's Sylvian family dresses fit on LPS. So yeah, so this is one Sylvian family's dress. If you don't know what Sylvian family is, I'll put an image on the screen somewhere. So yeah, so you can see what it is. Anyways, so she was ten to fifteen dollars as well, similar to the short hair cat, and she has she's in really good condition, other than this few scratches, like the nose and a bit of the eye here and other than that she's in really good condition and she's authentic as you can see quick peg so yeah she's authentic and i'll be using these in video i also have some few pets from may's toy store so i'll be reviewing those it also has my wish list it also has my wish list dream pet in it so stay tuned for that video that video is going to come out soon so yeah um well yeah i'll see you in my next video which will be later because i'm still moving so yeah i hope you can understand um yeah i hope you enjoyed your video and video i mean and yeah bye p.s this might be my new setup from now on because like i moved and everything so this is my new spot it's outside the window so natural lighting <laughs> bye